And good morning, everyone. Welcome inside the Carrier Dome. We're about a half hour out or so from uh, Cuse Lacrosse today at Top Rank Maryland. But before that, an historic morning, day, afternoon in the Dome. That man, Gary Gate, will become the first player in the storied history of Syracuse Lacrosse to have his jersey retired. Glancing up at where his uh, number 22 will be up in the rafters uh, shortly. His captains currently talking on the video board, giving uh, their head coach getting ready for his second game in charge of the Orange men's program as uh, he gets ready to have his jersey retired today. And as he does that, his brother Paul delivers a tribute. <laughs> My brother Gary and I grew up on Vancouver Island, and like most of our friends, we played multiple sports, like soccer, basketball, rugby, and lacrosse. We had great success as young athletes that resulted in a call from Coach Simmons inviting us to play lacrosse for Syracuse University. With the help of our teammates, we quickly adjusted to the college style of lacrosse, but it was during the NCAA tournament in 1987 that we realized college lacrosse was no different than the lacrosse we grew up playing. From that point forward, we knew we had the team, and if we could apply what we learned growing up, we could win. Gady cracks his yeah. fire score, score! When the dust settled on our time at Syracuse, our team went 42-1, and had three NCAA national titles. Our 1990 team is still considered the greatest team of all time. The team that has dominated for the last three years. And Gary, of course, considered the greatest player of all time. But it was more than his four-time All-American and two-time National Player of the Year honors that made him different. It was his creativity that set him apart. Stop it! Tremendous goal! First time ever have been done, I guarantee you that. Here he comes! this day, Gary applies the same principles he used at Syracuse to coach his teams to success. Gary's number 22 has become the symbol of success for Syracuse lacrosse, and I'm proud to see it hang in the dome forever. In the dome. Fans. Please welcome to the field Director of Athletics John Wildham, Dr. Ruth Chen, and today's guest of honor, number 22, Gary Gate. Please join us in welcoming Gary and his family. And we now ask that you please turn your attention to the top of section 329 in the east end zone as we raise Gary Gate's number 22 jersey for permanent recognition. Presenting the number 22 jersey to Gary Gate is Syracuse Director of Athletics, John Wildhag. And now Gary would like to say a few words. I just want to thank my family, my lovely wife, Nicole, uh, my kids, my, my parents, my in-laws. Um, Syracuse lacrosse has been everything to me. Coach Simmons, back in the day when he gave us the opportunity to come to Syracuse for great education and to play lacrosse, changed my life forever. And it was an incredible opportunity to come and play in front of the greatest lacrosse fans in the world, Syracuse University Lacrosse. You guys are the best, you're awesome, and I appreciate all you guys that come out here for every game and really cheer on the team. Um, I wanna thank uh, our athletic director, John Wildhack, um, for providing me with the opportunity to lead the Orange and 
have a chance to, to move on from the past, which was a, a true treat and a pleasure, and build the future. And I look forward to taking the 2022 team to the next level and getting back to that championship weekend and giving us a chance to claim our title. Thank you all very much. Congratulations, Gary. You've joined the ranks of Syracuse legends and will forever be recognized for your amazing career. The great Gary Gate, the guy right there that looks like him, Paul Gate. He'll be getting that 19 up in the rafters before too long, uh, one would imagine. And uh, Gary's going from a, an honor for the greatest player of modern times to his toughest test coming up in uh, less than half an hour when he will be the head coach in his second career game against the number one team in the country. So Gary and the number nine orange and the top ranked Maryland Terrapins will be right down there in the field. Join us again coming up at noon. If you're watching the game or watching this right now on ACC Network Extra, you're going to have to uh, go back out and uh, re-click on the game to come back in. If you're watching the game on Cuse.com, head on over to ACC Network Extra on the ESPN app to get this here today. So Gary Gates, 22, hanging for all time in the Dome. We're back here at noon with Cuse and Maryland. <laughs>